Well, another news story for you this morning. The flu usually starts uh, to spread as early as this month, and that can last until the spring. Palo Suro shows us now is the best time, though, for you to get your flu shot and get one for your kids as well. As a mom, I feel it's my job to protect them and try my best to keep them from getting sick. That's a lesson Andrea Martin learned during a tough time. I actually had a scare with him when he was about four months old. He was admitted to the hospital. So this week, she's taking them to get their flu shot. Tell them, you know, every year the shot is like two seconds of pain versus if you were to catch it, it could put you in the hospital. That is what the Cincinnati Health Department is trying to avoid. They're encouraging you to get your flu shot to not be one of the 200,000 Americans hospitalized for the flu each year. Especially for children, for example, with asthma, if they get the flu vaccine, it may not be fully effective, so they might still be at risk to get the flu. Now, every year the flu season can change being as early as October or as late as April, so the vaccination requires changes too. Some years we do a great job. The predictions are right on. But when the predictions aren't on point, that's when we have higher rates of hospitalizations. That's when we see deaths happening due to flu vaccination. So their strategy is to show you what to do to keep your family safe. Another thing you can do to not get the flu, just wash your hands with soap and water for at least 15 seconds several times a day. Paolo 09 on your side.